Could you all please stand? For the, and uh, Councilman Griffin, if you can lead the body in the uh, Pledge of Allegiance. It's America. And to the Republic uh, thank you very much. I uh, apologize for being late starting this meeting, and we, we're going to try to move as expeditiously. Oh, I don't have a mic. Can you hear me? Do I need a mic? Can everyone hear uh, the council me? president? Yes. Okay. Yes. Yes, we can hear you. Would you read the call of the meeting? Yes, ma'am. The special city council meeting today, June 30th, 2020 at 9 a.m. Uh, the purpose of the meeting is to approve legislation appointing members to the Board of Ethics and any other such business as presented. Held here today in both in the city council chambers, Mount Vernon, New York, as well as Zoom and Facebook.com. Councilwoman Duarte. Present and at home. Okay. Councilwoman Farkason. Present and at home. Councilman Griffith. Councilman Thompson. Councilman Thompson, if you can come off mic or, or, or mute, I'll help you if you like. There we go. Yes, present and at home. Thank you, sir. Okay, and Council President Copeland. Thank you, Madam President. I have um, resolution uh, number one, a resolution appointing members to the Board of Ethics of the City of Mount Vernon for a, a one-year term. So moved. Second. Councilwoman Duarte. Aye. Councilwoman Farkason. Aye. Councilman Griffith. Councilman Thompson. Uh, aye. And Council President Copeland. Item number Res two. Item number two. I have a resolution appointing members to the Board of Ethics of the City of Mount Vernon for a two-year term. So moved. Second. Councilwoman Duarte. Aye. Councilwoman Farkason. Aye. Councilman Griffith. Councilman Thompson. Thompson is on. Thank you, sir. And Council President Copeland. Yeah. I couldn't hear that. I'm sorry, would you repeat twice the motion, sir? Thank you. I cannot hear. One second. I'll help. Does he have a microphone? No. I have an ordinance extending a memorandum of understanding between the city of Mount Vernon and 20 South Second Square CMV LLC for one year. So moved. Thank you, Council President. Question? I have a question, Madam President. Uh, yes, Councilman So I note that it was yesterday that we were informed that this um, MOU has expired. And I see that all the stops were all the stops were pulled out to get that legislation. Councilwoman Ferguson, that's not true. They sent okay. a letter to us May 29th. Please let me finish. And I know that all the stops are pulled out to get that legislation prepared for this morning. We have not had the tree ordinance prepared. We have not had the ban on gas powered leaf blowers prepared, but this one could be prepared expeditiously. I wanted that to be noted for the record. Thank you, Councilwoman. And for the record, they did send a letter on May 20, 
6th or 29th of this year and it got lost in the, I, you know, I don't know what happened to it as I said in my email to them and I certainly copied all of you on it. Uh, corporate, did you have something? Corporation Council you wanted to, to say? Yeah. I think you need to get your mic. Can y'all hear him? No. Oh, okay. You yeah. Question, Madam President. Yes, uh, uh, Councilwoman Duarte. Um, I don't understand why this was rushed to put on today's agenda when we even haven't had a chance to discuss it. What, what's the difference? Nothing between... to... Yeah, but why not just do it at the next council meeting? Let it come into the packet. Let it go well, through. I, I, can I? I'll answer both of your questions. It wasn't a rush. It was missed. It wasn't uh, put put on by mistake. It expired June 29th. It's a year extension of the memorandum. It's not voting on anything else on this project other than the extension of the memorandum of understanding. Further, I wasn't sure how many votes it had and I thought it would need two readings. That's why I put it on today. So, so it's, ma Madam President, if I now, may. Anyway, any if other I, council person have something on this before they continue? Councilman Griffith, you're up. Did you have something to add? Councilman Thompson? Yes, Councilwoman Parkinson. Thank you, Madam President. Um, I, I'm glad that you said that. That because that's what happened. Yeah, but you, you know what you said is, is that because it will require two meetings, what you are doing is forecasting and and demonstrating what your priorities are, Madam President. Please remember, this is you are a member of the Federation, uh, um, Conservative Society for, for for Westchester County. The, the tree ordinance is an important ordinance, or it should be for someone like you. Thank you. So, as so as Corporation Council said, the, the tree ordinance, which we did vote for and approve, which was vetoed by a former mayor, needed some changes. That's why it's not on. I do support the tree ordinance. I've never voted against it. You all met as a committee several times with the tree ordinance people. It could have been on today if it was ready and I would have voted for it. So I resent the implications of your remarks. I resent you trying to tell me what my priorities are. You don't know me. You know nothing about what my priorities are. But I did know that this had slipped through. If the, the, if the blower was on today, I'd vote on it. I, I, listen, it's an insult to my character and I resent it. And I want that on the record. Call the roll, call the roll, no more discussion. Call the roll I on have this. Another, call the roll. Council, council. Council, Councilwoman Duarte, I, I have I'm another sorry. comment. I apologize, Councilwoman Parkinson. I have another comment. Councilwoman Duarte, I'm, I apologize, Councilwoman Parkinson. May I have your vote, please, Councilwoman Duarte? Uh, same. Thank you, ma'am. Cal Councilwoman Parkinson? No. Reason for her extension on the record, Mr. Clark. So I just think this is rushed. I'm, I I think that this should have gone into the packet and I don't see why we couldn't vote on this at the next meeting. Thank you, ma'am. Councilwoman Farkasen, how say you? No. Council, Councilman Griffith? Councilman Thompson? Aye. And Council President Copeland? Aye. Is there any other business to come before this body? If not, I'll entertain a motion to adjourn. I wish you all the best this 4th of July. Stay safe. I will be somewhere recuperating, which I will not say since we're on Facebook Live and Zoom and all kind of stuff. And people show up that are not even your friends when they find out where you are. So be safe. If you're going away, uh, mask up if you stay in town. I entertain a motion on adjournment. Is there a second? Is there a second? Second. Thank Roll you. call on adjournment. Councilwoman Duarte? Aye. Councilwoman Farkasen? Aye. Councilman Griffith? Councilman Thompson? Aye. And Council President Copeland? I have stayed, and I'm abstaining because I wanted to fight some more, but I have a board of estimate. No, I'm just kidding. Aye. Adjourned. Thank you all. Thank you. Be safe. well.
Good fortune to see you, Council President. Yeah. Yeah. I hope it's still on Facebook. Hey, I'll call up the chat. And then she wants to come with me and talk about it.